Well, guys, it's an old-fashioned plow day is what we're doing. It's just first part of this video is just going to be a complete plow day. We have tire bug here with the uh, Farmall 706. We took the loader off and we put big duels on her. There's tire bug up there. Honestly, his setup looks nice. I love we got the red plow that matches. Now, this is just like an in-game plow, so I don't know what actual brand it is. And then we have Brett with the 8300. He's got the wheel weights on here, dude. He's got the rear wheel weights on the duels with the big duels and uh, the 30, 30 duels. And then he's got a five bottom plow. Now, it's not a deer plow, even though it's green. It's kind of a different, it's it's a European plow. It's a uh, Amazon, Amazon or Amazon, Amazon, Amazon. Maybe it's just Amazon, but uh, that's what Brett has. And then I have the 4020. Maybe we could have put a five bottom plow, but only we only have a four bottom plow. So the same as uh, the international here. Now, guys, giveaway. Everything American won the giveaway last week but of course this week we're giving away something so all you gotta do to enter is comment down below in this video i know i'm gonna have a ton of comments just comment down below you can say nice things if you want i'm i'm it's I, it's just a random uh software that picks a comment so that you don't have any better chance um but comment down below i think give a video suggestion would be nice i don't know i just look for video suggestions and stuff but all you gotta do come about comment down below subscribe to the channel and like this video and you will be entered to win fs19 a copy of your choice i will announce it at the end of the week coming up this saturday in the next live stream we're gonna do this every single week until fs19 comes out so you gotta register down below boys and uh it'll be interesting it'll be interesting so everything american won the first round we'll see who wins wins the second copy i guess we're gonna we're gonna give away six copies so i'm gonna follow tire bog and brett and we are head to field number two. Oh my gosh, man, there's a collision in the roadway. Oh gosh, okay, I think they're good. <laughs> there they go. Oh, this will be fun, man. We should have got more people. Now, I was going to use... Here, I'll, I'll kind of show you guys once we get here. But I was going to buy some older deer tractors to use. But uh, I didn't want to... Some older classics, like the 820 here. Like like these tractors. Um, If I can go over here. Uh... Like the 80 diesels and stuff and the 820 diesel. I was going to buy some of those older ones, but they didn't have a three-point. So I should have, if I could have found a plow that was a drawbar plow, that would have worked perfect. So we got everything dissed up with the 89. Now we just left a little bit, kind of for some fun plow. To, okay, wait, wait, wait for everybody. Hey, okay, actually tire ball can lead. Yeah, that, never mind, that's good. Tire ball can lead out there and then I'll follow Brett. Okay, you guys got to tell me, make sure I have the plow the right way. Because I always get this screwed up. Tire ball, are you going the right way? I think I yes. I think that's the right way. Okay, yes, you are. And I'm the right way too. I Brett, think. Flip yours. There we go. So we want the we want the ground to flip to the left. It should push it to the left here. Yes, that will or no, mine will flip it to the right. I gotta flip mine. Okay, hold on. We gotta flip mine just once and then we should okay, so turn plow. There we go. Okay. I'll follow Brett. We got tire bog here. Uh, Brett go and get started. <laughs> we got the 4020 boys doing a little polling. Oh, this will be sweet. Oh, we're kind of sorry, guys. If you there, he goes. Now he's got her. Oh, there you go. He's flipping her. By the way, guys, sorry if we're if we're plowing wrong. We could. I've never plowed in real life. I've I've witnessed it. I've had my food plots for deer plowed up in real life, just right in front of me and stuff. But I've never actually done it. So I could. We could be screwing up a little bit. I apologize. I really do apologize if uh, you guys are mad because you guys. Okay. Oh. <laughs> what is going on here? <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. He should be able to. Oh, there we go. Should be able to. Uh, I'll tell you if you're the right way. It's a, his plow is a lot different too. Yeah. There we go. Oh, right there. Now drop her down, and we should be good. Oh, what? No, 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 no. You had her. All you gotta do is drop her down. Wait. No, no, no wrong way. Never mind. You're right. You're right. You're right. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> we're trying to get this plow figured up, but there then we're going to go, guys. There we go. Dire bugs got her. Oh, shoot. I'll move the 4020. Close. There you we go. You should be able to line up the center point with the edge of the row. Oh, okay. There we go. Brett's going. And I'm coming behind. Nice. Okay, as long as I'm actually plowing, we're plowing. We're plowing, boys. Okay, we're plowing at 9 mile an hour. Oh my gosh, dude. 40 20's plowing fast. I'm plowing at 9 miles an hour, too. 
There we go. We'll th take cruise control. Nice. Look at her go. And so we uh, were actually bush hogging this. So you guys can see the difference right here. Nick, I think Nick was, somebody was bush hogging this. So you can see where we mowed down the stocks and where we didn't mow down the stocks. Just right, right along there. Nice boys. Okay. Is nine mile an hour maybe a little too fast? Or actually you got to plow fast. You want to plow fast. So never mind. Nine mile an hour is probably fine. 40, 20, just going along. She's not even rolling coal that much, to be honest. There we go. We will lift her up, rotate her, and then work our way back around. Everybody make sure you rotate. Oh, oh, okay, I we're taking that. Split it too. Okay, don't rotate. Oh, what are you doing here? Oh, you're just gonna go down the middle? Okay, I guess it doesn't matter what way we roll it. I'll try to line up with you, I guess. There we go. Nice. <laughs> Sweet, we're doing good. Oh shoot, there, bait. We're good. There we go. We're good. Okay, I'm right behind Brett. Tire bog. You going through there? You go a little slow. Can the can the farm all not handle it? Oh, I see. You're struggling back there. At first, you well, weren't you running nine mile an hour heading up this way? I thought. Yeah. Hmm. Look at the forty twenty. Just roll coal, baby. Oh, we should have uh, fueled up. This is sweet. Just watching her go right along here. Okay. And the corn textures. I love the corn textures we have here. So we're going to try to get most of this done, guys, with plows. We'll see. Uh, if it takes forever, we'll just take the 89 and just kind of disc it up. That'll work fine. <laughs> hey, we can also switch tractors to, uh, like after a couple more passes if you guys want to try uh, different stuff. Okay, did you you flipped your plow, right? Okay, everybody's flipping the plow. There we go. Flipper, and we'll keep going. Oh, wait. Oh, okay, you guys didn't flip it. Oh, shoot. No, there we go. Have to flip it cause you just oh, because you turned around. Okay, makes sense, makes sense. I'm just, I was getting a little confused there. There we go. Nice, and now tire bog's running fast. Okay, now you're running at 9 mile an hour. That's weird. Let the 4020 just do her thing, man. There we go. It would be nice if we could see hear the engine just revving out like a ton and stuff, you know, just really, really pumping stuff, but I don't know. It's uh, Right now, it's pretty easy for the 4020. Maybe we'll have to get a 5 or 6 bottom. Okay, somebody's got to take out these corn. this corn. Put her under. Put her under, Brit. <laughs> there we go. Nice. <laughs> doing work there's tire bog with the 706 run for with the 83 now i was wanting to get a big plow for the 89 but um the 89 is just it didn't have three point so i would have to get a draw bar plow and for some reason there's not many out there uh i could have got the big bud plat pack and the big bud pack has like a little dolly it pulls behind that it's meant for big buds because big buds are on three point so that would have worked um i should have added that in here and we could have pulled the big plow with the 89 that would have been fun. But right now, it's cool seeing this uh, old iron go. You know, the 4020, watching her go. Um, the farm all, and then I guess a little bit, some new, uh, or some young iron, I guess you could say. Uh, Brett's 8300 up there. Yeah, I think it's because I'm pulling that slap right hill. Oh, I see you. Yeah, because on our, when we were going this way, you are doing just fine. There we go, dude. I got yeah, a time lapse this. Oh, nice, guys. I got a time lapse this when we get done, cause this is uh, or when we really get going, cause this is gonna be uh, this would be a fun time lapse. I'll let someone run for me. Okay, tire bog. You gotta switch me, man. Show me. I'll take, or I guess we can all we can all switch around. So right now, guys, I'm just hiding my HUD. This is how you do it, I guess. Um. Right there. Okay. Um, unless... Br okay, Brett's, Brett's going right there. Okay, tire bog. 
Take the 40 20. I'll test out the farm wall. I feel like a lot of people want to see the farm wall run too. <laughs> oh, dude, I love the duels on it. They're just huge. Oh, oh, this is sweet too. The no cab view. Open station. There we go. Okay, we'll drop her down. Get going. Oh, she's pulling hard. We could go all night. We could run all night, guys, like this. There we go. We're actually getting a lot done here. Well, it's this might not take long to get all this done. Getting her done. Oh, by the way, so for you guys here, I'll kind of talk a little bit. Um, For you guys who are, I mean, I guess I've been talking this whole video, but uh, so for some reason, I got on the server, and do you guys know how I wasn't able to feed my cows? I wasn't able to feed them bales for some reason. And I get on the server, and bales are there. They're all fed besides... Everything but, um, everything but, let me show you here. Everything but power food, which we don't have a power food mixer, so I understand why. But somebody found a way to jump on my server and feed them. And I got to figure out, I think we, I think me and Tirebog figured out how they did it. They put it in, like, there's a different feeding trough, one that was kind of tucked back a ways. And we think that's where they put them. So we should be able to actually do cows now. I did not know that. I didn't, I, I thought for sure we, oh, I was like, oh no, all of our cows are going to die, you know, but. It's actually gonna work good, I think. Wow, we're getting this done pretty pretty quick, actually, with three of us going here. There we go. Okay, I'm running at nine mile an hour now. Now we're running at nine. It might get a little tough here. Oh, this is where we slow down. <laughs> it's just sweet watching her go. Maybe we could upgrade to bigger plows. You guys think this is probably good? Probably. It's probably good enough. I mean, my uh, farm all is having a tough time over here. So, Tire Bog, you're in the middle of harvest right now, aren't you? Yeah. How's how's that going? It's going. You guys halfway done with harvest, or? Pretty close, yeah. Hmm. Okay, so there's Brett with the 83 going. Tire box should be coming across there. I love how that 4020, it rolls pretty good amount of coal. It's just cool watching them go there. <laughs> oh, that's just sweet. There we go. And now he's good. There we go. So I think what we're going to try to do, oh gosh, we're pulling hard up this hill. Come on, pull through. There we go. And I think what we're going to try to do is uh, most likely, dude, you know what I should have done is I should have actually had a plow day during a live stream is what I should have done. That would have been sweet. Man, that would have been cool, actually. Okay, maybe I'll... I don't know. I, I could save some of this, I guess. And I could just, like, you know... We could have a plow day during a live stream, and we could have people... Buy people trucks and have them haul out their trucks and stuff. Or haul out their uh, tractors with their plows and stuff. And have, like, you know, ten trucks lined up with trailers. And then everybody unloads their uh, tractors and stuff. We get plowing. Knock this out. That'd be pretty fun. Okay. Maybe I'll leave just a little bit of this. I don't know. We'll see, I guess. There we go. A300. Brett, once you get to the end, you can switch me. If you want to jump in the 706, I'll try out the 8300. That way we can kind of test them all out. Alrighty. Shoot, I was missing a little bit there, guys. Kind of lagging a little bit. It's kind of cool, this uh, open station view we got here, too. Ooh. Is this sun starting to go down okay it's mid-autumn right now <laughs> the sun's definitely starting to go down I think I dark out okay we'll lift her up perfect okay Brett I'm gonna get you lined up over here and then we can uh, we can we can shift it is getting dark out on the server wow it was just sunny like a second ago it seemed like okay perfect 706 I'm out of her Brett you can jump in her and I will tab into the 83 there we go. Oh, actually, here, let's save this. Let's just finish up this section over here. I want to save this. Save save that section right here. We'll go and finish this little tiny section here, and then we'll be done with the plowing. Everybody's got to turn on their lights now, dude. It's getting dark out. Okay. Brett, are you on your left or right side coming down there? You're on your left side. Okay, so tire bug, go to the right. We might... I, I guess you guys might not need my help here. We'll see. I'll let Brett come down here. I think we got one more pass, maybe. Be a little strip. Okay. I'll drop her down and then let Brett come in and finish. 83, she's pulling good, too. 
I mean, this is a five bottom plow, so it's got it's definitely got the weight and stuff. 83 is a lot bigger tractor. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, we got a little bit left. I can kind of get most of this here. Me and Tyrebog might have to do a pass coming down here yet. There we go. Now I got most of it. Perfect. Okay, dude. And after this, we'll have to start cleaning up all these tractors and stuff also. So it's the next morning. We got everything plowed up. Brett fired, just fired up the farm all, getting her warmed up already. So it's a little dirty, man. It was getting kind of dark out there. 8300 is pretty covered. 4020. Oh, she's a little dirty. The plows are really dirty. So we're going to kind of clean all this off. And you know what? I kind of bought the plows thinking, you know what? I'm just going to sell them right after. But we're going to throw them in storage. And this is going to be like a tradition. Every time we have a harvest, I feel like. And I'm actually going to make it a live stream where we all jump on here and start plowing too. So. For now, we're gonna store the plows, and we're not. Uh, we'll use them probably next year, I guess. Yeah, we'll use them next year. So we'll clean them all off first, though. Um, I'll jump in the 83, and here's the power washer here. Okay, I'll pull the 83 around here, and then we'll wash this quick. <laughs> and then we just got a tractor line right here. 83 is clean, and then I gotta clean my plow. She is dirty. I gotta figure out what shed I want to put the plows in, though thing there we go she's all clean okay i got the 4020 coming in we'll clean the plow is that a coon oh that's a coon plow i was like i didn't know what brand that was but that's coon okay i didn't know that there we go and then how are the cows doing we may have to feed the cows again 4020 is a sweet tractor dude okay 4020 is already clean okay and then the farm all there we go farm all everything's clean okay perfect okay we gotta put okay let's put these i'm thinking guys let's put them in the uh the shed with the combine over here just this far one right where everything spawns i got to certain like kind of name my sheds i guess the the big storage shed is what we call her i didn't even know you could take oh yeah you could take the loader off i love dude i love that farm all we have farm all and the 4020 we got some sweet tractors around here definitely this is probably one of my best like equipment lines up line up lineups we've had okay tire box gonna back her in and then brett's gonna back her in and then uh i'll back her in perfect there goes Brett. Dude, I want to, for some reason, I want to just leave duels on all these tractors we have. Just duels are cool when you have them on it, all this. <laughs> it just looks, oh, shoot. Oh, there we go. Everybody dodged each other. Nice. Brett will back her in. I'll let him get out, and then uh, I'll, I'll throw her in. Perfect. He dropped his. He's going to get out of there. Back this in. Okay, so how are the, I guess they're good on water. Base food, they're good on. We need a power food mixer is what we need now. That's the next thing we really need um, to get the cows going. So I think I'm going to try to buy that, and we'll see if we can't get that done here. Okay, we'll just drop this five bottom in here. <laughs> and uh, these won't be used until... Oh, shoot. Let me rotate it just so it looks real nice along with these. Okay, it's probably fine right there. I can't disconnect it. Hold on. There. Can we disconnect it now? There we go. Okay. We're good. Perfect. So we have all of our plows here. The four bottom, the five bottom. Then we have the grain cart combine getting stored away. Um, the headers. And we got the bush hog over here. I should probably move it. I put that there, but it usually goes in the other shed. I'm going to... Actually, it's fine. It's probably fine for now. Okay. What tractor... Wh okay. What tractor are you guys thinking we should run on the uh, mixer? The big power food mixer probably the one you're in the 83 or the versatile yeah we could 83 or versatile um let me think here so let me see the power food mixer we need enough horsepower too i think it requires like 220 horse we'll go to animals quick it, it requires 240 horse do we have a tractor that's 240 horse the 83 is definitely not it might be i don't think the 83 is that much horse though well, let me check around quick. 240. I think the Versatile does it. The Versatile is kind of a small tractor, though. It's a thing. Versatile is 260. 260. Okay. What does the 83 have? 230. 230. Oh, man. And it requires 240? Yeah. Oh, okay. Where's... I kind of want to use the 83 still, but does the 83... Will the 83 work? It'll probably work still, right? Yeah, it should. Yeah. Okay. Let me get the 83. Should I take duels off for this? I feel like it'd probably be nice taking duels off just to move around, but then again, there's going to be a lot of weight on the back of the tractor there. 
okay how much does this mixer cost we may have to borrow some more money oh my gosh oh one hundred and sixty eight thousand dollars wow we only have eight cows too is there a smaller mixer there is a smaller mixer we could use but we might as well just get the bigger mixer wow okay so we are maxed out on our loans right now i need to probably repay some of our loans let me check here yep we are we're maxed out on our loans so we got to repay some loans so what we have to do is add in enough money to get the mixer right here and then did we plant winter wheat over here were we able to get that all the winter wheat planted i think we were yeah, okay one. okay perfect there we go so yeah the next step is uh getting some money okay so here we go i've added in money now we need to purchase this thing and then uh we got her okay now what we need to do is start loading up all these bales so okay we need a loader tractor we need a loader probably on the 74 oh, okay there is a loader on the 7400 um we're probably gonna i don't think the bobcat's gonna be able to reach up there so the bobcat might not work probably a loader on the 706 if we can but uh definitely we're gonna need those so i'm gonna grab the 83 we'll hook up to uh the big power food mixer <laughs> dude that thing is huge and then uh we'll start mixing everything up I think we have enough silage. We should have, yeah, we should have enough of everything. There we go. Okay, I don't want to take the duels off because we're going to need duels. There's just going to be so much weight on the back of this thing. It's probably best to get duels. Keep duels on. There we go. We'll back in. And right now, I haven't used my controller at all this video, guys. You probably have noticed that. Right about there. Connector and PTOs connected. There we go. The 83 is going to be pulling this big baby. Nice. Okay, so we're going to need silage, hay, and straw. I got to figure out where all this stuff is. So I guess start loading up silage. It's not all together, so I'm going to have to kind of run around the farm a little bit. Okay, uh, tire bog, keep the bucket on because I'm coming over for silage. We'll start loading that in. Okay. There we go. 83, man. And we got to probably move our ripper, too. We got a ripper over there yet. Now, this silage is kind of messed up. It's like, I don't know. It only blanketed half of it. It's super weird how it did that. So, kind of have to mess with this. Check it out. I'll kind of just pull through here. Perfect. Um, Back up a little bit. Brett, if you want to grab the 706, you could. And throw a loader on it i know i think you can throw a loader on yeah you can't throw a loader because we've had one but you can probably take the duels off and then uh toss a loader on the 706 so we got to unblanket that do we or we'll just go open silo bunker silo was opened okay there you go you should be able to huh oh there we go uncovered only half of it what the heck we should have uncovered the oh there we go okay now you should be able okay perfect you're able to actually grab it nice we kind of have a small bucket though that's the thing i could we'll see if the bobcat will reach maybe there's a chance the bobcat could reach i'm gonna jump in the bobcat i don't know if this thing is gonna reach but we'll see and i guess we really don't need that much feed so a couple scoops should be good for now oh we got okay we got the Oh, I don't have the bucket on here. I gotta get the bucket for the bobcat. Uh, is that it? Nah, that's definitely not the bucket for the bobcat. Huh. Okay, I guess it's fun for now. I'll use this for bales. That's the one thing. It's tough to reach. It's tough to reach up in uh, up in there. I'll start moving some bales over there. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna move some bales over close to the tire bog. I'll go grab some bales. Oh shoot! There's Brett coming across there. Brett, there's a bucket right there, right in front of the shop to your right. It's like tucked up, tucked up by the fence there. All right. Okay, so we need some straw and some hay bales, right? Or do we need straw? We don't need straw. Silage? Yeah, no, we, we do need. We do need straw for the power food mixer. Wow. Okay. I'll pull around here and start grabbing some bales. There we go. So we got technically three loaders here. Two tractors and one skid loader. Pull around here, jump in here, and okay. There's grass bales. I gotta figure out where my hay bales are. Well, here's some uh, here's some straw bales. We'll grab. I think I can grab two. Grab two at once. 
<laughs> I grabbed him way too low. Oh, man. Oh, come on. Bobcat can lift him. There we go. Nice. Oh, okay. Let me readjust a little bit here. I don't want him to roll away, though, at the same time. Shoot. Okay, I'm just going to hold him. We might as well. I kind of grabbed him way too high, but it's good. There we go. <laughs> oh, dude. I love this track, Bobcat. It looks nice. Everything about it looks it looks clean. It looks... I like it. It's like the first year they came out with tracks, too. They're one of the first models, I guess. There we go. I'm making my way over to you guys. I don't think I'll be able to load this up in here. Uh, I may have to have you guys grab them, but... Oh, I guess you guys don't have the bail spear on your... Oh, shoot. We're tipping. Okay. I'm going to try to work my way up in there. We'll see, though. We'll see. Okay. I'm going to do only one at a time, I'm thinking. Get it as low as you can. Yep. That's what I'm thinking. And then I'll kind of have to leverage my way up in there. Okay. I can probably go lower. Okay. Lift, 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 lift. Okay. We might be able to make it. I might be able to make it. Oh, yeah. Ah. Right. Oh, there we go. We got it. <laughs> That's right. I remember Nick having to do this. I wish it was... We were so... Okay. That'll actually work. Okay, Tire Bob, what are we at for mixtures? Here we go. Um, we need some hay and probably another straw bale. Okay. Coming in with another straw bale. Shoot. I got. I grabbed that way too high. we probably go lower. I think we'll be good on silage for now. Perfect. There we go. Okay, this. Nice. Okay, this should work good. I just need a little bit of ramp to get in there. If I had just a tad ramp, tad bit of ramp. Come on. <laughs> Man, that is a little messed up. It's fine. It works, though. Okay, I'm going to go grab some hay bales. I think they're on the... I got to go through the cow pasture over here. I'll, I'll bring uh, two hay bales, and then we should be pretty close then. Okay, we gotta open up this. Oh, there's two right there, actually. I think they should be. Technically, they should be. So right now, we only have eight cows, guys. These cows you see standing still aren't cows. The ones moving are like our cows we actually own. The other ones are just kind of like, I don't know, pictures, I guess. Okay, so we have a ton of hay in here. Perfect. It hasn't disappeared. Okay, I'm gonna grab two. There we go. <laughs> Dude, the big skid loader, I'm trying to think. In real life, it'd be tough to haul two at once. It'd probably be tipping. Let's see. How much do bales usually weigh? Like big, heavy hay bales. Probably over 1,000 pounds. 1,500 pounds or so would be fair, I'd say. So 3,000 pounds. Yeah, it'd be pushing it. It'd really be pushing on a skid loader like this. Oh, gosh. We're kind of tipping. Stay. We're good. We're good. We're good. There we go. Okay, let me shut the gate quick. Okay, so all we need is hay, right? Hay, and then we should be good. Should be. Okay. Perfect. I got my bobcat right here. Let me drop one of these. I guess I could try to get them too, but I think it's going to be tough. I'll do one at a time. Oh, shoot. Oh, my gosh. Oh, shoot. This isn't good. This isn't good. Oh, I've had... Oh my gosh, man. Me and Nick have had this happen before. Oh, dude. Oh, there we go. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Okay, Brett's just stuck. Oh, dude. Oh my gosh. Everybody's just... Okay. It's a little tough. Maybe I grabbed too low. I kind of tilted a little too much there. Wow, that was a little messed up. Okay, anyways. We will... Uh... There we go. Okay, last one. I just need a loading ramp. That'd be perfect if we just had a loading ramp. I don't want to get my fork stuck in there this time, though. Back away, though. If you back away, it'll fall in. Oh, true. Nice. Okay. I'll need is some more silage. Some more silage? Perfect. I'll get. I'll jump in the 74. I'll load you up. You stay in there so we get the perfect amount. Oh, shoot. Okay. Tractor collision. We probably need to take duels off, guys. <laughs> Even though I love duels on our own tractors. We should probably take them off. It's kind of... Unrealistic for a chore tractor. Wait, is that? Oh, that's chaff still. That's so weird. There we go. We probably need a big wheel loader or something. Okay, Brett's jumping is. Brett, I'm coming in behind you. 
Nice. Should be about close. Man, this seems so full, I bet. What are we at, Tire Blog? How much more do we need? There we go. Brett's dumping is. Oh, shoot. There we go. Perfect pull in here with the 74 razor up. And dumper. This should be it. Maybe one more bucket. Yeah, that's it right there. Perfect. We're good to go. Okay, Tire Blog, get mixing her. And then, or actually, okay, I can pull the 83 in. And then, okay, we gotta figure out where we gotta, we, we gotta figure out where we're gonna feed these at, too. I'll back the 74 in since we're done with the 74 for now. Pull her in here. We should be good. Right there, there we go. Perfect. 74 is backed in. Okay. Tire Bog's taking the mixer. Now, I'm thinking, here, Tire Bog, I'll open the gates over here. Uh, I think it's this way. Or where are you feeding them at? Yeah, I think you need coming over here. here. There we go. I think it's a center. Oh, you think it's in the barn? Oh, okay. Okay. I'll open the gate for you. Or the door. If it can open. Oh, I think I got to get inside or something. Oh, wait. No, there we go. No. I don't know if we're going to be able to open this. I don't know if this opens. Okay, so we're in here. Huh. I don't think there's any way to get in here, though. Okay. Oh. You can open that way. But you can't open this door. Okay. What tire bog? Maybe try pulling in here in the feeding trough. Over here. Do you think that'll work? The blue Over, feeding trough? Yeah, we can try that. Okay. Just come right through here, and we should should be good. What, what's that more? I can help you out with that uh, barn for the garage doors. They got two indoor switches. So the one closest to the house, when you go through the door, it should be right there on your right-hand side. If you go okay. The center. We'll try that if this doesn't work. We're going to try this feeding trough right here. We'll see, though. Okay. Is he giving you an load? Oh. There we go. We're good. Okay, so it's this trough right here. It's going in. It's going in. We're good. Yep. Perfect. There we go. Tire box feeding them. Okay, we're full. Nice. And how much do we have left? Like a ton in there, probably? Seven tons. Wow. Okay. <laughs> there we go. So we're good. Cows are fed. Now, <laughs> there goes Brett flying through here. Give me a rod, Brett. There we go. Nice. <laughs> He's pulling through here. Okay, we'll go through the pasture, so we got them all fed here. And then, uh, tire bog, where are we going to put that? Should we just leave the 83 outside? I don't think there's any good place to... I could maybe fit in a sh shed, I guess. We'll see, though. This works good. I like the setup we have, and I'm glad we can actually feed the cows now, guys. Anyways, guys, this will be the end of the episode. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy it. Hopefully, you enjoyed the pot. Oh, the cow's going to get out. But, uh, anyways, guys, I will see you later. Don't forget to enter the giveaway by subscribing, commenting, and liking this video. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you.